I will show you my market scan routine, my market scan method for how I how I find setups and which all coins are looking strongest to uh, to trade basically. So I have different watch lists here and a um, good friend of mine, Jimmy, which is also in the Burb Nest, Nest team has, uh, as I requested in my webinar yesterday, has merged the Binance USDT list with the FTX perps and removed all the duplicates. So now I have a list with all coins on Binance versus USDT and all perpetual futures contracts on FTX without heavy, having any duplicates. And that is 262 pairs right there. I am going to go through the FTX list here because that's only 120. So I'll show you what I do, right? So first I have this list with 120 pairs. Now my trading system is based on trading with the trend. The way I identify the, the trend is by using the daily 20 and 50 EMA as well as the four hour 20 and 50 EMA. You can see here that the dotted lines are the daily moving averages and the uh, solid lines here are the four hour moving averages. If I go to the daily, you will see that the daily moving averages turn solid here. I will be doing the first part of the scan on the daily, right? And what I look for is I want to see something interesting in terms of a trend, right? Because of the fact that, well, you know, you look at Bitcoin, it's very, very clear at just totally uh, invalidating the whole bull market at this point, but I am still actually looking for longs on all coins because as, as long as Bitcoin is trading above this area, I do feel that the uh, risk to reward is higher on long opportunities. So what I do is I look at all coin market and I have one simple question when doing the first part of the scan. And that is, is the coin above or below the daily moving averages, the daily EMAs, the 20 and the 50 EMA in a daily? If yes, I'll add it to the green list. If no, I'll keep it as it is and i want to add it to the green list right that's the first part of the scan now what i look for in a scan might change what, what i what i look for in a scan might change uh, a little bit depending on the market structure right but right now we are looking at all coins that are reclaiming the daily 20 and 50 may and that's because it's a sign of relative strength because you will see that most coins are below the daily 20 and 50 may and that would signal a short setup for me but because of the fact that i'm, I'm looking at bitcoin as as support i'm looking for longs so let's start this right? i will just go through like half the list it's going to take 10 minutes and we don't have 10 minutes to just do this part is one inch uh, above the daily 20 and 50 may no it's on the green list and it was interesting yesterday so i'm uh, removing that from green list we're looking at abe and uh, nothing interesting here. ADA, well, you know, got that fake out. It's it's actually above, so we got to keep that on. Uh, this is this is gone. Algo, nothing. Alpha, nothing. All perp I, on, I have on the green list is because it's a uh, uh, altcoin index, but I'm removing that from this list. Uh, uh, and before, I, yeah, this is on. I don't know why, but it's on uh, above the moving evidence. And then you have Atom, which is actually still above the moving evidence. Uh, audio, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. So this is what I do, right? And you can you can do this quite quickly, right? All you need to do is you have to have the daily 20 and 50 EMA on your chart. And if price is above, you add it to the list. BNB, no. And as you can see here, I have a, a list already. So that's what I do. And then I everything that's above the daily moving areas, I add to the list. And this is the green list, right? This is the green list that I have saved right here. And we're going to go through this list. And this would be the second part of the scan, right? This would be the second part of the scan. First part of the scan is an overall picture of the overall trends. Do I want to long this? If, if, if answer is yes, I would like to long this, but I'm not sure where or how, you add that to the list. Now, this is part, it, it's now time for the second scan so the first scan takes me about 
somewhere around i'd say five minutes and then the second part could take anything uh, anywhere between five minutes and, and an hour depending on how many coins and uh, uh, how difficult it is to find uh, or to see a setup you know so the second part of the scan happens on the four hour time frame so first daily then you look at the four hour right so we have luna which is right now i believe one of the strongest coins and when when doing the four hour trend uh, scan the second part of the scan i add the four hour 20 and 50 ema now the plan is that you know this is on on, on the list because it's actually in a daily trend and above above at least daily 50. now what i want to see is a four hour trend right a four hour trend this is a four hour trend this is a breakup trend right so we need to bounce here create a maybe equal highs a higher higher low now this would be the start of a new trend and that's the trend i want to be trading now there's no setup here for luna right at this very point i, I do believe that this is a fairly interesting level right here but i don't like the fact that it's breaking the trend so this is will be on my list but that's just because everything looks like shit right now so if every if something looks slightly decent it's probably going to be looked at as relative strength right so we go to the next item on the list and that is atom and now honestly i i i feel like and i should also add that i have two sections on my watch list right here section number one and section number two if you don't know how to add sections you right click right here and press add section the idea with with these sections is the first scan is uh if 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 if, if i do find a coin which has a potential setup in the um, next couple of hours or the next couple of days i will add it to the number one list if there's a coin which is above the daily moving evidence and something that like something sparks my interest but there's no setup lining up just yet i'll add that to the second list and it, the, the, the first list will be the one that i scan on a daily basis i will use alerts to alert me if anything happens of interest in in this list right here so let's do this again atom well you know we had that trade uh share that trade um on on, on youtube as well and, 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 and with you guys live atom had a good run but it's now going down to the second list because it's a break in market structure luna actually also down to the second list ftm well down to the second list because of the break of the four hour trend ethereum uh, well you know what i'm just removing ethereum because it looks like shit. and uh, one is definitely one is gone i'll remove one kava is is absolutely well still some something happening here so it's on on two then we've got near that's a two ample whatever actually you know what i have to keep that on one and then ftt on a one we go through this list once again do we have anything interesting here that should be moved up to list num crv gets removed from the list and what am i doing here right so why am i removing some well first of all link is below the daily moving evidence and it's totally breaking this uptrend so it's now in a downtrend i don't like i'm looking for longs i don't long a downtrend right so link is gone from the list we got matic is same thing here gone wi-fi is gone and uh, dot is gone k and c uh, is actually slightly interesting so i'll keep that one and then omg is gone stx i'll remove that one and ada a ada what the fuck is ada cardano ada um yeah actually quite interesting so i'll move that up to the first list and we do a quick scan again is there any, anything that should be moved up to the first list no 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 and no all right so we have uh three coins of interest right now out of 120 perpetual futures contracts on ftx these are the three all coins that i i do believe uh is is coins that would potentially be able to signal an entry trigger for my system out of all those 120 coins and not even these three looks very strong right now so my overall feeling for the market is bearish and we're definitely in a risk off environment right here and bitcoin is moving lower so we need to be very 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 careful trading right here and the long setups needs to be very very obvious and, and looking at this one for example we'll probably wait for a test of these levels lower and that's why i have that alert right there so i now know that rest of the week or at least rest of the couple of days in the future i will only really be be, be interested in this green list and really 
only three altcoins here which is of uh, interest to me all right so that's basically it that's how i scan the markets and i base it on the moving averages right i basically look at is price above the daily 20 and 50 may is if, if, if the answer is yes move it to the green list then i go through the green list on the four hour and i look for clean and clear four hour trends above the 20 and 50 ema on the four hour if that's the case i'll have them on the top in section one and if there's a setup coming up i have that on the absolute top so i will monitor the uh, section one on a daily basis right because that's the most uh, interesting all coins and uh, why i'm able to do this so quickly i mean i can do a scan like this one in in somewhere between five minutes and, and 15 minutes so i do it very quickly and i can probably scan you know 500 coins in in under 30 minutes and that's because i know exactly what i look for i know exactly what my system needs to enter a a a, a, a trade i need i know exactly what the market needs to do for my system to trigger an entry trigger so the idea is like when scanning the markets, you know you need to understand what you're looking for. You need to understand what you are looking for first and foremost.